Hello, in this lesson, I want you to identify linear, quadratic, and exponential functions from given data. I want you to write the equations that model that data. First off, if you're given an equation, the way to tell it's linear is going to be the form of y equals mx plus b, or it might be in standard form like ax plus by equals c. If it's quadratic, it's going to have a squared term. And if it's exponential, your exponent is going to be in the variable. If you're looking at a graph, a line is linear, a parabola is quadratic, and then you have an exponential curve. Numerically, if the first differences are the same, it's linear. That is, if, I, if my, x, my change in x is constant and my change in y is constant, then it's linear. If my change in x is constant and I don't have my first differences being the same, but the second difference is the same, then it's quadratic. And then finally, if your differences aren't the same, but you divide them and always be the same, then that's exponential. So let's take a look at a couple problems and a couple of ways we're going to do this. First, we're going to graph. Take a look at a graph here. So I've got negative 2 and 5, negative 1 and 2, 0 and 1, 1 and 2, and 2 and 5. See how that forms a parabola? So that's going to be quadratic because it forms a parabola. You can solve this problem with technology just as easy as you can solve anything else. So for example, if I graph negative 2, 5 on Desmos. So now how do you graph an ordered pair in Desmos? What an excellent question. You just type in the ordered pair. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go parentheses, negative 2, comma, 5. There's my first point. I could put a label if I wanted to, but I'm not going to. Then my second point is going to be negative 1 and 2. So then we're going to graph negative 1 and 2. There is my second point. My third point is 0 and 1. So I'll graph the points 0, 1. And then our next point is 1 and 2. And then finally, 2 and 5. And notice how we get a parabola here. Since we get a parabola, it's quadratic. 